Hello everyone, I'm Rick Zanotti, and I'm recording something in Adobe Captivate just to show you how all the full motion software simulation recording happens. We are in demo mode, and I'm recording in 1440 by 900 screen resolution, which puts that between uh, 720p and true HD. So 1440 by 900. I'm going to go to YouTube. Dot com slash relate casts. Now this is our site where we keep all of our podcasts, which include eLearn Chat, Shrek Tech, and coming soon in September 5th, eMedia Chat. Now when you go to the channel, you'll notice several things right up front. We landed on the featured page. If I click on featured, the same page comes up. Then you have a feed tab. This shows all of the videos as they are either being posted or commented on. So anything that's going on with the video shows up sequentially, chronologically there. Then we have our videos tab. These are all the videos that we've uploaded from time immemorial. Now, actually, in this case, we uploaded these videos about a week ago because we converted from Vimeo over to YouTube.com. You also have playlists. And if I click on that, you'll see that we have one, two, three, four, five playlists. Now, those include two of our shows, uh, one called I Has Gear, which is a website we're developing. That's all about microphones, audio, video, cameras, whatever gear you might want to know about or have. Relate Corp ones, those are ones that we do for our corporate that um, it's usually me talking about a specific subject. Then our favorite videos, things that we like or enjoy that we think are pretty well done. So if we head back, I want to hit the back button. Now we're back on the main screen. Again, you can see a lot of the videos that we've done. Keep in mind, I am recording this in Adobe Captivate. So everything you're seeing is done by Adobe Captivate. We have a search capability on our YouTube channel, as do all YouTube channels. If I click on that and I type in LMS, for example, that brings up three videos where we discuss learning management systems. Uh, two of them are primers that I did, and the third one is an interview we had with Nicole Fougere from Litmus, uh, a, a New Zealand company which has a very good learning management system. So, and actually, I think they've been acquired uh, by a stateside company. Anyway, so. You can do any kind of link, or I should say search, rather than there. If I type in black eye, you may wonder why are you typing in black eye? Well, one video comes up, and that's Gina Shrek, who in her last Shrek Tech video actually had a black eye, or more, I should say, a black cheek. Uh, she got hit by a glass table. Actually, the glass fell off a glass table and hit her in the face. Fortunately, she is okay, but there is a remnant which is a little bit of a shiner. So again, if we go back to our page, we can click on the logo here for a lay cast, and that takes us back to our landing page, which is the featured page. On this page, you see information, let me go back up here, you see information on our site, what we are. These are the co-hosts that work with us. For example, if I click on Colleen, Her website should pop up momentarily. Here we go. And that opens up in a new window. If I click on Gina, so this is Gina Shrek. You could see that her website pops up. And we'll click on Kirsten Rourke as well. These are all the co-hosts from the shows we do. And her website pops up. So anyway, and down here we have, again, our featured playlists and the following down here are channels that we have linked to the Adobe Captivate channel is one that we have iSpring is a product we really like uh, the, the Adobe eLearning channel that is from Dr. Alan Partridge and other people at Adobe so these are channels that we like and really enjoy all right so that's a brief overview of how to navigate our website now, another thing that Captivate does is it does capture full motion video. However, and here's a tip, it will not capture it when you are recording in software simulation mode. So if I come here to one of Jeff Blanchard's movie, 
He's our Australian friend, a uh, really good guy, does a lot of Captivate development. If I click on his video, you'll notice that you probably are not seeing full motion. The car just walked into the scene. If I click, it stops it, and I'm going to start again. So there's a lot of motion that's not being captured because we are not in HD capture mode. Just something to keep in mind if you think you can capture everything sequentially. I'm going to go back. And we are back on our page. So just keep that in mind if you are trying to capture full screen video in a software simulation, it won't work. It'll capture things like this where I'm scrolling and it's pretty clean at that. It looks actually very good. But it won't capture the full screen motion unless you go into HD recording mode. Just keep that in mind and you won't have any issues when you do your recording. All right, I'm going to wrap this up. That gives you an overview of how to use our channel. And keep in mind, this was all done with Adobe Captivate CS6. Have a good one, everybody. My name is Rick Sinati.